Morning. Morning. How much are you after on the games? Um, 50p each. 50p, yeah. The ones in the yellow bag. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no worries. Thank you. Twelve seconds later. So, actually, I'll give you a. If I can find it. Not on there. I'll grab that one. Thank you. Thank you. Change. One second. Morning. Hi, Al. How much are you after on all the, uh, the box sets and everything? Uh, box sets in one pan for. Cool. And singles, 50p. Blu rays. Can I can I give you the money for for that one? Yeah. Pounds, yeah. Uh, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Morning. How much you after? How much you after on the uh, the, the game? Pound each. Pound each, yeah. I'll leave him for now, thank you. Is this your one, mate? Yeah, I've it. Sorry? Is this your one, mate? Do you, do you know how much uh, storage is in that? I don't know. How much are you after on it? Five. Five, yeah. Is it, is it hard drive? Yeah, it's a, st a storage. Uh, what's it called? Um, portable storage. But Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let's try and figure out how much storage it's got. Would you take three quid on it, mate? Give me four. Mate. Yeah. Yeah. No got a change of uh, five. Yeah, yeah I've got change. And we are back, YouTube. For anyone who's returning, thank you, and for everyone who's new, welcome. I'm Mitch, and this is Retro Rummage. Aim of the game in this channel is buying games, DVDs, Blu-rays, any electrical items I can get my hands on. Uh, car boot sale, charity shops, uh, yes, at a low price, so I'm getting them traded in at CEX for a high price. Saturday boot sale today, um, very, very quiet, not many stalls, um, yeah, not many sellers at all, to be honest. Obviously, it's getting really close to the end of the season now. Uh, I'm noticing that most of the stalls are just resellers or, you know, like people who are selling like brand new stuff, and, and it's nothing that I'm really interested in. So, slim pickings today, unfortunately. Um, in terms of what I spent, not a lot of money, but, um, and, uh, and sorry, and in terms of what I picked up, not a lot, but what I can trade it in for, pretty decent uh, value, to be honest. So I'm not upset, but I'm not over the moon either. <laughs> so I'll, I'll get into the uh, pickups. So first pickup of the day, PlayStation 3 game, G1 Jockey 4, 2008. Now, there was, they had a stack of these games going through uh, on the PlayStation 3. None of them were really jumping out at me. Um, maybe like, I think there was a Ferrari Challenge one that I, th I thought would have been worth more than what it was, but um, it wasn't worth anything. 
This one did stick out to me, but I will, I've ne obviously never seen this game before. I had a look at the other ones, thought no, walked off, had a quick look on the CEX thing, and yeah, this one trades in for three pounds. So I think I paid a pound for that, or maybe 50p, can't, can't remember. Um, but yeah, 50p pound into three pounds. So yeah, as, as PlayStation 3 go, uh, games go, that's that's not too bad. Um, and then second pickup of the day, we've got George A. Romero's Trilogy of the Dead. So you've got Night of the Living Dead, Dawn of the Dead, and Day of the Dead. Um, yeah, it is complete. I think I paid a pound for this one as well, um, and it chops in for four pounds. So yeah, again, happy with that. One pound into four pound. And yeah, the last pickup. This is probably the saviour of the day. I, I'd been round um, once, and I was doing like because what I normally do is I'll, I'll run round, look for any games, or if there's any like box set DVDs uh, that you know jump out at me. Because if there's like a box set Blu-ray one. Um, it could be worth quite a lot of money. So I always look for those. And then what I normally do is go around again and have a, a, a slower look at each of the stalls and have a look at all of the electrical items they've got for sale. Um, and yeah, I've clocked this one. So let me unplug it. It is a WD My Book. Now, when I first looked at it, um, I thought it was like a, a router. Um, but after infer further inspection, it is a an external hard drive. It's WD My Book. It's Western dimensions i think or destination something like that it's, it's a well-known brand um i had a quick look on the cex app and they was selling these uh sorry ex exchanging these they do every anything from like a 500 megabyte megabyte version all the way up to six gig um with six gig i think being like maybe 55 pound chopping value so the lowest one was maybe 10 pound chopping value uh, i think the guy originally said he wanted a fiver for it um, managed to get it for four pound, but yeah, I've got it home, tested it, all working fine, and it's the four ter sorry, not gigabyte, so it's four terabyte. This one, um, so yeah, um, that trades in for forty two pound voucher, so four pound into forty two pound over the moon with that. So, so yeah, di didn't spend a lot today. So what was that? Four, uh, four, five pound fifty, and it chops in for like fifty something pounds. So. 10, 10 times my money today. So, um, like I was saying, yeah, not, not great in terms of what I picked up. Um, but, yeah, in terms of, you know, the the exchange rate, shall we say, really, really happy with that. Um, so, yeah, uh, for, thank you for watching, everyone. Uh, thank you for subscribing. Thank you for commenting. Thank you for liking everything. I really do appreciate it. Um, I'm probably, maybe, fingers crossed, by the end of next week, going to be at 1,000 subscribers, which is you know, it's out of this world for me. I'm, I really, really do appreciate it. So once again, everyone, thank you. Take care and I'll see you all in the next one.